We are currently at a Western Sky Middle School, and today one of my students, who's a seventh grader named Max, is coming in today to talk about what he's been doing with the 3D printer behind me. It's a 20-year-old 3D printer, and he was able to fix it, which is a super big deal. And I'm gonna go to preheat, and I'm gonna go to left tool. It's at 25 degrees Celsius right now, and it has to get to 200. Also curious about what was back in the closet over there. So I asked if I could go look, and there's a giant 20-year-old 3D printer sitting in the closet on the floor with a bunch of stuff shoved in it. He found an old 3D printer back there and asked if he could work on it. There were a couple of things broken with it, and I got those all fixed, and now it's working. So taking a certain technology that's older than him and being able to transform that is pretty amazing. When I was little, I loved taking things apart. They may or may not have gotten back together, but I loved taking them apart. And when I put them back together and they worked, that was super cool to me. And I just liked the feeling of it. And now I can start loading this filament. Warming up back up the bed, and then once that's all warmed up, then we'll be good to go. It is very um, motivating because that's what we're here to do. Um, take care of our kids, service our kids, provide them an opportunity to explore, learn and grow within what they need and where their interests are. Um, and we can't do that without our teachers. I definitely want to keep inspiring students. I want to keep working with all types of students and everything to get them to, you know, to achieve their highest potential. I want to get other kids interested and I don't want to be the only one. I have certain eighth graders that's kind of saw what he was doing back there and you know super curious and really it gets them excited too. We were fortunate enough to have Miss Lucier join us this year um, and take on this challenge. This is um, the her first year with us as well as her first year being a teacher um, and has really had a vision for our STEAM program. Yeah, I want to continue to keep my class like you know make it a safe space make it a comfortable place for students to express themselves whether it's something like what Max did they can fail they can learn they can do whatever they need to do to be a better student. This is way better and it just got me excited and now that she's made a huge difference in this and it's awesome now I love it I really like this class if I could stay in here all day, I would. It's very exciting to see like students like Max create something or fix something like that and be so inspired to um, make the world a better place through STEAM. I want to work with clean energy and hopefully get rid of a lot of pollution. That's one of my main goals. He's going to change the world when he gets older, which is super incredible, and I'm really happy I get to be a part of that.